Unfortunately, the heart of downtown Indianapolis recently rocked by violence. Yeah, three people were shot outside the Fairfield Inn, which is off Washington Street, right next to White River State Park. So there were three people shot. Two of those people died and a teenager survived. Today, our Steve Jefferson talked to her parents about this gun violence in our city. The victim in this case told her family she was attending a party here at the Fairfield Inn in downtown Indianapolis. Her parents are hoping who's ever responsible for the shooting is caught. This is Kennedy White, who loved taking photos, especially with her family. The 18-year-old is one of three people shot downtown at the Fairfield Inn and Suites and the only survivor. She'll be able to go back home. You know, but our heart does go out to the other families whose children didn't make it. Can't and will never go back home. And the big question is why? Kennedy's parents want to know why someone started shooting around 1 a.m. Monday outside the downtown hotel. Two men died from their gunshot wounds. Their daughter spent most of the night in surgery. She not only just celebrated her 18th birthday this month, but had plans to participate in Wednesday's North Central High School graduation ceremony. There's nothing wrong with people having fun. I think you should go out and have fun without having any worries about if your loved ones is going to make it home. The gun violence is just out of control. Although witnesses are cooperating with police, investigators have not named a motive and called the deadly shooting an isolated case. Either way, the 18-year-old's parents want someone held accountable. Right now, we just going to go moment by moment, day by day, and hopefully she does heal like we're expecting her to. Well, hopefully that this individual, whoever he may be, decides to develop a conscience and turn himself in. If you have any information that could help in this case, call Crime Stoppers. You could do so anonymously, 317-262-TIPS.